so hello lovely people welcome back to the channel it's your girl it's been a while i know ever since we entered 2023 you guys have not heard from me i've got cold my hair is out that's why my face looks a bit mm, somehow however i'm happy to be here i'll be having so many emails People DMing me on Instagram asking me when I'm gonna return back on YouTube if I'm quitting. No, I'm not quitting. I am just excited to be back. Yeah, I managed to you know upload some videos for you guys, but um, it didn't go on live because I wasn't hundred percent sure if I showed or not. So from today onwards, uh, you guys are gonna see the videos. I hope you guys love it. By the way, today is 14th of February and it's a Valentine's Day. And um, in my office, we're having something beautiful. They wanted to, you know, get everyone to prepare something to bring it to the office for us all to enjoy since it's Val's Day. Listen, Val's Day shouldn't just be celebrated just for one day. Every day is love day. However, this particular day, I personally think that you have to show love to those people who are single, people who are lonely, let me put it that way, lonely. And uh, yeah, I really enjoy some snacks, although I didn't cook anything. Last year, I made jello fries. I don't know if you guys have watched that video. I'm going to pop it up here so you guys will see. By the way, before I continue my conversation with you guys, if you're new here and you've not subscribed, what are you waiting for? I would love you to join this family. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for tuning in today. Yeah, so for the year 2023, what plans do we have? Um, let's just say that I've started well because ever since we entered the new year, you guys have not seen me. Not because I don't want to be on YouTube or I don't want to upload videos, but it's just because I just want to enjoy the moments, be with my family, especially my adorable gifted son uh ethan uh and uh i'm just enjoying i mean just being with my family and friends and um you know that there, there comes a time that you don't have time for anybody not even your family or your friends you're always busy busy uploading videos here and there yeah so i just want to take that time just to enjoy with them very well and then obviously since i'm back now you guys can also enjoy me by the way, I just want to say a big thank you to anyone who reached out to me, checking up on me, whether I'm fine, um, or whether I'm quitting, which I'm not. Also, the second thing is um, looking forward to um, work on myself, especially having time for my own self, uh, skincare, uh, name it, travel, name it. Um, what else? Just taking care of myself. When I say myself, my family is excluded. It's just me. Me, 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 me. Yes. It has always be, been my family, my family, my friends, my friends. So it's time for me to have time for myself. And I think it's good. Not because I'm being selfish. No. Sometimes it's good to be a little bit selfish for yourself. So yeah, it's good. And the third point that I want to talk about would be working on this project that i've always spoke about well i've not told you guys what exactly but i've always said i want to do it i've always said i want to do something but i don't but i think it's hard time i start something even though um i'm not gonna you know do everything but at least start from somewhere just so i know that oh i have something doing so yeah that'll be the project and the fourth thing would be just enjoying life because one thing I've realized in this recent months is that not because I hear any bad news for my family thank God that God has really given us uh, countless grace you know so I can't really complain that much however we are so grateful to God that none of none of my family members are ill or dead or anything but the kind of news you hear about people you know some are celebrities some are people you know way from school some are from uh, some are you know people that you know around and it's quite sad that the number of people dying are not 
elderly people by young people and sometimes it just prunes you and you're like wow people some of them weren't even sick they just went to bed and couldn't wake up but it's just by God's grace we went to bed and we are alive and he has given us the grace to be counted among the living I personally think that we should be very 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 grateful to God for that yeah so yeah and uh, there are young people dying and it's quite sad seriously speaking and uh, nobody knows what tomorrow holds when God is gonna call I mean you or me eventually we will all die but nobody knows when so what I always say is keep working if you are working work hard save some of the money do your best to travel do your best to enjoy life don't keep all the money in your bank account thinking oh yeah you're going back home to you know build houses so you can live in um did any of those people who passed away knew that they were going to pass away i would say no most of them had the idea that they were going to build houses most of them had even built it already but could not even sleep in it so this is the reason why i always say that just enjoy the moment yes make sure that you save some of the money yes but do travel do enjoy life do have time for yourself go for checkups yeah because you may not know whether you are sick or I mean you've got a certain illness and you you don't even know so I would, I would advise you to go for checkup go to the doctor frequently yes if not every month maybe three months every three months or six months just go for checkup just so then you know what is going on in your body don't just rely on the fact that listen we all believe in God yes even the doctors that we see them at the hospital they also believe in God but um my police says God won't come from up there to come and give you common sense that listen you are ill you have to go to the hospital yes you do you have to pray that's the first thing you need to do however you need to go and see the doctor to see what is wrong with your body just so you know what you can do do you get what I mean so don't take your health for granted guys and the last but not the least is ah we'll be focusing more and more on YouTube this year I don't know in what month but uh, I'm I'm going to just try my best to post a video. It might not be frequently or consistently as last year or the past years. But I hope you guys will pardon me on that. And with that being said, do share my video. Do like the video. Comment down below. Let's interact with each other. And uh, subscribe if you've not done that yet. If you know anyone who hasn't subscribed yet, speak to that person about my channel so they can join this family. By the way, I just want to give shout outs to these people, to Josephine, to Vivienne, to, <laughs> to Elizabeth, and uh, to Flo, yeah, who just joined us in the UK. I will have it on my channel maybe the next time I upload a video, I don't know when, so don't rely on that video because I don't even know when, but uh, what, I, what I know is I'm happy that she's here in the UK now, she joined her husband, and uh, thank you guys so much for always supporting me yes i know those who support wholeheartedly thank you so much may god richly bless you and for those who don't also support god bless you too because you may have your own reasons one or two reasons which is fine everyone has their own opinion that's okay so god bless you too so until next time in my next video i would say bye for now but before then enjoy this short video that i did at work concerning you know this valentine day brooch you know with these pastries uh, these snacks and etc enjoy don't forget keep spreading love and peace mm -hmm. you did. I did yeah look so cute hello ladies hi um, Days I'll be held in your hand from the moment that I wake up until I lay my head, oh, I will sing of the goodness of God. 
Oh my life, you have been faithful. Indeed, he has been. <laughs> oh my life, you have been so, so good. I will say of the goodness of God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. God is a gracious God.